so it's been a while since I've done a voiceover. I felt like doing a voiceover. <laughs> and I am doing a really simple, just classy, bougie, ratchet, simple, no, classy, bougie, simple, full set of nails on myself. I am obsessed with Young Nails acrylic and cover earth as you guys can see if you've been watching uh, you know a lot of my past nail videos that's pretty much all I all I use I am gonna step outside of that you know in my next couple of videos because I know that it's just time to switch it up but I just love it I love how neutral it is and how it's just simple and it goes really well with my skin tone if you have like darker skin tones that is very very good for your skin but you guys, I am, you know, doing my nails over again. I got tired of them looking ratchet. <laughs> um, so basically, I just clipped my nails down from my previous set. And I'm really just filing down my nails. All of the products and tools that I use can be down below in the description. Um, so you guys can go check that out. But most of the products that I have and that you guys see me using, I did purchase from either Young Nails or Amazon. That's pretty much, you know, my go-to for nails. Um, I'm trying out some different brands, but pretty much, like, my go-to is Young Nails and Amazon. Um, I do like Poochie's nails, but all her stuff always seems to be sold out because she does sell to unlicensed. Um, nail artist so you know she has some good products but you know just make sure you watching it because she does sell out a lot but I'm basically just filing my nails down you guys and don't be like me with this nail nipper I left my nail nipper in some bleach y'all some bleach water because I didn't have any more um, like cleaning solution and I actually forgot about it and it rusted so don't be like me know take care of your implements and your tools because they will rust and they will go bad and I really don't recommend using rusted tools on yourself but you know that's just how I'm rolling today so don't come for me don't judge me <laughs> um, but I, it took me a really long time to file this stuff off of my nails because I did um, do it a little bit too thick thicker than I like and y'all like I'm just gonna be honest like I haven't really been consistently doing nails in a long time I am licensed but it's been a really long time since I've been in the salon doing nails and y'all like I've kind of gotten rusty it's, it's taking me a minute to kind of like get back into the flow of things and when I was in the salon I really didn't do too much acrylic too much full set so, you know, y'all are going to see my progress as we go along. You know, hey, if, if this is all a journey. This is all a part of the journey, the process. So y'all are going to see all of this. Um, so that's why y'all are seeing me use so many different um, bits while I'm, you know, trying to file this stuff off my nails. Um, and to clean my nails, I don't use anything really special. All I use is alcohol and sanitizer mixed together. That's pretty much all I use. And I love this Young Nails Protein Bond, y'all. This stuff is the bee's knees, yo. This stuff is the bee's knees. Your nails won't be going nowhere with two coats of this stuff while before you apply your acrylic. And, you know, if you are using polish, I definitely recommend using it before you apply your polish, whether it's gel polish or just regular nail lacquer, nail lacquer or just nail polish, how we used to polish back in the day. So... Y'all did see a little bit of the acrylic still left on my nails, but that's going to be okay because, you know, we are using a cover pour um, acrylic powder, so you won't be able to see any of that. And I don't know if I addressed this, um, I think I addressed this in one of my other videos, but I just hate using nail tips. It's just, ugh, I just don't like using nail tips, y'all. But to me, using nail forms is so much better, so much easier so much more customizable and it's quicker to me in my opinion there is a little bit of a learning curve but once you get it you know it's pretty much just like clockwork um, if you do want to start using forms I definitely recommend using young nails forms just to start off with because I think they are a lot more beginner friendly and they do have a lot of videos on their YouTube channel that you know
you know, kind of just shows you how to use, you know, their your nail form. And I know, um, if you guys didn't know, and this is not a whole Young Nails review or anything like that, but I just really love their content. I really love their education and their tools that they have for, you know, the experienced, advanced nail tech all the way down to, you know, the beginner newbie. Um, but he does offer nail courses on his Instagram every morning. If you're on the East Coast, it's at 1030. He starts at 830 on the West Coast. So um, very informative, very informational, educational if you want to like really get the bread and meat and potatoes of doing nails because y'all like this man knows his stuff um so and i don't know anybody else who offers free nail education on their instagram every single day monday through friday so y'all go check him out um it's young nails on instagram i will leave that in the description but it's young nails on instagram you know if you are paying attention to what i'm saying if you have made it this far in the video then you pretty much know what I'm, I'm talking about and if you really want to go check that out you can go check that out um but yeah I'm gonna let you guys enjoy the video I hope you um you know learn something if you don't I hope you are entertained you know whatever it is I just hope that you enjoy this video
right you guys so I'm using this Marcorette if I'm saying that correctly um, nail foil glue it's actually really really good if you like using nail foils like me I really love nail foils because they're just a really cute simple easy way to get just something cute and simple on your nails without having to do too much um, but because I do want my accent nail to be more of a feathered type of look you know less of a I don't know how to explain it but I, I don't want all the nail foil in one spot so that's why you see me using um, this nail brush to kind of just feather out and get a little bit a little bit of the product off of my nail so that I can get that feather look um, but like I said y'all if y'all haven't checked out nail forms man y'all are missing out because they are the bomb I actually plan on doing a ombre with nail forms. Um, I did it before, but it didn't come out right. But I am kind of sure that I got this method that I have in my head that I'm going to use that is going to make it a lot better. But this is it, you guys. I'm going to just throw these little nail foils on here. Throw some Poochie's top coat, which is my favorite top coat of all time, my Poochie's no white top coat on here and we are going to be done it is going to be like lost in the sauce type of done i don't know if that makes sense but it's going to make sense today so i am done um i hope you guys really enjoyed this video like i said before um poochie's does have really good products on her website but like i said because she does sell to everybody not just um licensed professionals her products are always usually sold out but if you ever do get a chance to go on her website i will leave her link the, li the link is down below to where you can go check this top coat out um because she does have some really good products but like like i said you gotta stay on it because man like her stuff sells out really really quick so i will see you guys on the next video let me know what you think if you have some questions let me know how you feeling how are y'all feeling during this crazy 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 quarantine um this 2020 y'all this 2020 oh, this has been a year like it's only been six months and it is just rough like how are y'all feeling how's everything going um, let me know down below. So, yeah, I hope you like this video, and I will see you guys on the next one. And until then, peace.